Tonight, a nanny is facing criminal charges for allegedly stealing thousands of dollars worth of property from several of the families that she worked for and then selling it online. Police say 21 year old Cassidy Woodworth, a student at Grand Canyon University, admitted she did it after the victims she worked for noticed that some things were missing. And this afternoon, more victims are starting to come out. Team 12's Antonia Mejia spoke to one of them and she joins us now live in the 12 News Alert Center. Antonia. Caribe spoke to a Phoenix mom who tells me she hired the ex nanny from care.com. She also tells me the 21 year old student she seemed trustworthy and she even passed her background checks. Being a nanny is a huge part of my life. 21 year old Cassidy Woodworth worked as a Valley Area nanny since at least March of last year, but she's now facing charges of theft and trafficking stolen items. You took my daughter's stuffed animals, the ones that slept in their crib with them. <laughs> you took those from the little girls that you claim to love. Woodworth is accused, though, of stealing more than just stuffed animals. Valley mom Kelly Rickard says these are the hundreds of children's items Woodworth stole from her home. The ex-nanny's family later returned the items. Baby clothes, accessories, shoes. You know, we, we treated her like family. I thought of her as a little sister or a, you know, a daughter. Kelly is just one of four families now accusing Woodworth of stealing and selling their children's stuff. Court documents reveal Woodworth is accused of taking about $10,000 worth of toys, gift cards, and clothing altogether. The victims say she apologized and returned some of those items, but only after they noticed their missing baby clothes were being sold on Poshmark.com. It just makes me not be able to trust. Kelly says she never suspected Woodworth of taking her stuff until she got an email from Care.com notifying her that her nanny's account was suspended. One of the bullet points on that email said it could potentially be due to, you know, theft and stealing from a family. And at that point, I reached out to the family I knew she was with most recently. They confirmed they caught her stealing. She had admitted it to to the Paradise Valley family. Then I sent Cassidy a text and Cassidy admitted through text to me that yes, she had been stealing as well.